Hi, this is Vinayak Matho from VM Graphic Solutions and welcome back to the for Premiere Pro tutorial series and in this video I'll be uh, talking about what is called as an unmixed master and how to uh, merge various audio files together so let's get started and fire up Premiere Pro Till the time Premiere loads, I would like to get your attention to my YouTube channel, which is on youtube.com slash c slash 1996. You can also find this channel by typing my name Vinayak Mathur in the search box and the first link would be mine. You'll find a lot of videos, tutorials and lots of cool stuff on my channel. So I'll request you to please subscribe and do visit my channel so that you can get all the latest videos. In your mailbox and your subscription list without you manually searching for them coming back to premiere we have our project ready we'll open it and this time I'll be doing something different till now I just showed you how to import files how to edit in the timeline obviously basic one but still how to do that today I'll give you a situation so if suppose I have given you a dialogue file which of an mp3 which has all the dialogues and a background score and I ask you to give me a merged file and an unmixed master for it how will you go through so this video is all about that so first of all I'll just control a to select all of these raw files and hit delete now this is as blank as a new file so I'll just import the dialogue sequence and the background score so here I have a dialogues file in which I have all the dialogues synchronized and I have a music so now uh, if I have to merge this what I'll do is I'll drag the music layer and then I'll drag the dialogues layer you can do this process in reverse also you can first import the dialogue and then the music irrespective of that you're going fine so now if I play the timeline you will be hearing a complete audio which has a background score and a dialogue My intelligence suggested Ramsey will be transported by armed motor theater to the Cassius Mountain Range. They cleared the range and reached their destination. Ramsey is as good as gone. So let me get this right. There is only one road that leads in or out. Sheriff drops at either side. A motor cage from hell protected by a small army from one mile either direction. So you saw I have an audio file. I, uh, sorry, I have a dialogues file as well as a background score working together. In a synchronized motion I'll get into details how to synchronize this in the next video but as per now if you have been given a dialogues uh, file and an audio file how to merge them this video is just about that so theoretically your work is done this is complete and that's it but you can't give a premium profile to a client and say this is your works right so now I'll get you on how to render this file or how to export this into an audio layer. Because if I save this right now over here, this is getting saved as a project. But I want a MP3 or a WAV file or AAC audio. How will I get that? Hit Control M on your keyboard or Command M on a Mac while you have been on the timeline. And you'll get this export settings dialog box over here in the format come to mp3 or choose a different format like waveform audio and in the output name rename the file choose the destination click save rest of the details will be fine because the premiere does all the work behind for you even if you th uh, even though if you still feel the need to do that you can just fiddle up with these settings but I won't recommend that 
especially at a level which I'm assuming you to be if you're watching this video that is a beginner stage I won't recommend you to do that and uh, that's it and over here this will show you a estimated file size which for this is approximately 3 MB and that is pretty decent as per what we see so now you have two options which is Q or an export now if you are using just Adobe Premiere and you want to export you can just click on export and this will set you free but suppose if you have uh, a lots of work a lots of videos to be edited and you know a couple of different things working uh, on your machine at the current point and you don't want to waste your time and just seeing an export loading bar you can just hit Q but obviously this requires another software from Adobe which is Adobe Media Encoder what that will do is that will fetch your details fetch your uh, music layers all those project details and work in the background with all the resources which are left after you be after you using so I'll not complicate it complicate stuff for you right now but I'll, it was just an option you can use an Adobe media encoder or a premiere itself right now I'll use Adobe Premiere only by clicking export because this is a very small file so that it won't take long but if it was like uh, about 30 minutes I would prefer to go with Adobe media encoder as it would do everything in the background without me getting interfered so anyway coming back now if I go to my desktop I have a music mp3 which contains all the dialogues and the music synchronized. My intelligence suggested Ramsey will be transported by armed motor data and to crash his mounted plate. So now suppose if somebody said this is the dialogues file, this is the music, this is the sound effects, merge them all and give me an unmixed master. Now first of all what is an unmixed master? Unmixed master is a source file where you can actually change the vocals separately without changing the sound effects or the music layer. So now how to get that? If you uh, see carefully we over here have two different layers. Let me drag this up for you. We have two different layers. One is of the music.mp3 second is of the dialogues so if I mute the dialogue I only get the music with all the effects everything set right so I have my music layer as intact in a separate layer and now if I suppose want to dub my dialogues in Hindi right now it's in English or any other language for so what can I do is I can just select the dialogues layer remove it and put a separate dialogue layer over here for instance suppose this was the second language I can just simply drag it over here and it's done I don't have to again mix the audio again change the levels pan it etc nothing it's as simple as just changing the dialogues layer so this over here in front of the, you in the screen is called the unmixed master so if somebody wants somebody says or the client asks you for an unmixed master you're going to give him this premiere project this file tutorial dot prproj this is what you'll give as your unmixed master while if he says he wants and complete audio file you'll give him this mp3 file which is which cannot be edited in future I cannot change my dialogues from this, I cannot change dialogues from this music dot mp3 it's all merged while I can do that from this premiere project so again this premiere project acts as an unmixed master for me while the dot mp3 is the final output I hope this gets you clear with the two different aspects of audio editing. So if you like this video hit the like button. If you disliked it click on the dislike button. Subscribe to my channel 
and it will help you to get all these videos directly into your mailbox and to your subscriptions list and if you have any queries any doubts anything you can get in touch with me on my facebook twitter gmail google plus on the comment section below anything and everything you know about me so till then thanks bye bye